Hello, Facebook, YouTube, how y'all know? Uh, the topic of this message, oh, the day of Uriel. Didn't do no uh, message this morning because I was helping somebody move. Um, thing is, uh, uh, I was talking about something uh, yesterday um, about uh, love the individual. And the topic of the message I want to show you that I was talking about, very important, it's called uh, uh, cook, The Reality of Rocks and Cookie. Uh, rock and Cookie, you know what I'm saying? Here's the thing, you know, rocks are solid structures that, you know, are hardened for a purpose. You know what I'm saying? They're hardened uh the 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 it's it's, it's 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 a substance that hardens you know can is very strongly that's why I want it's a hardened very strongly and but cookie dough is soft you know what I'm saying and the thing is cookie dough and it's soft and the thing is what I'm want people to understand about this idea is that when you believe what you believe in. Like, you know, people can strongly believe in things. You know what I'm saying? And, you know, as you can see that a lot of people believe in a lot of things that, you know, are contrary to reality. You know what I'm saying? Or contrary to what God has created things to be. And the thing is, you know, uh, a person can say that this is this, this is this, and they can say this is this is just so strongly and yell and say whatever they, I mean, feel strongly, you know, or, uh, you know, they get, you know, very confident in what they strongly believe and uh, do it to the utmost way. But if, if the substance is cookie, then guess what the, you know, the word says, cookies only crumble. You know what I'm saying? Cookies will crumble. I don't care how much you magnify it. I don't care what you say about it. I don't care how much you totally defend it. I don't care about how you, you know, uh, whatever you say, yell or, you know, how you may sound proper and you may properly explain it to whatever extent it is. If it's cookie, it, you can make it hard. You can put it in the oven and even cook it, you know, and and burn it or cook it softly. It's, if it's a cookie, it's going to crumble. You know what I'm saying? And the thing is, people don't realize it's all about the substance that it's created from. That is the will be the outcome of the situation. You know what I'm saying? But truth is like this rock. You know what I'm saying? Truth is a rock. Truth is a rock. A hard substance rock. And the thing is, truth, when you speak truth, no matter if you yell it, no matter if you speak, speak softly, no matter what kind of shape or form or way you express truth to people, guess what? It's going to be a rock regardless. It's going to be a rock and it's going to be solid and it's not going to uh, uh, conform. It's not going to conform. Like, you know, I got this idea of the cookie cutter. You know what I'm saying? People uh, like to cookie cut things. Or, you know what I'm saying? Uh, you make and manipulate things. You know what I'm saying? The certain things the way you think it is. You know, the cookie, we would like the cookie cutter lies, of course. You know, and shape and make things the way, the way, make it look good. You know, you know how people are popular are at doing that, making lies look good. And they like to serve and show people cookies and say, this is this and this is that. You know what I'm saying? And the thing is, of course, I don't care how good looking it is. I don't care how nice it looks or whatever. If it's cookie it will crumble, you know what I'm saying? Or how maybe solidly hard you, you know how cookies get so tough, you know, you got to break it quick, you know what I'm saying? 
if it's a cookie, then it will crumble. You know what I'm saying? More likely, if it's lies, it's going to crumble eventually. You may not crumble right then of you baking it or whatever. It's going to eventually crumble. But the thing of reality of the truth, the truth will stand. The truth will be a rock. You can take your cookie cutter and bing, 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 and try to see truth will break your cookie cutter. See, that's what I love about truth. It will break the cookie cutter. You know what I'm saying? It will tear the cookie cutter apart. You know what I'm saying? You can put whatever you want on that cookie cutter. Um, it's going to break. You know what I'm saying? That people try to, you know, people say, well, well, what about this and what about that? You know how people are talking against the truth because I love what Paul says in um, 2 Corinthians 13 and 8 he says you cannot do you can only do you cannot do nothing against it well you can't do nothing against the truth but for the truth you know what I'm saying only for the truth you can only do it you know what I'm saying you can take you know but people will try to cut rock best way as possible uh, cut you know they're going to try to cut the truth but the truth really can't be cut. You know what I'm saying? Because it's the reality of what exists and what makes everything there. It's reality. You know what I'm saying? But, you know, the thing is about lies. Lies tries to do whatever it takes to get rid of reality best way as possible. It can. If it has to hide it, which the popular thing of doing is to hide and cover rocks, cover the truth. Or, you know, whatever you, they try to do, cover the truth and give everybody cookies. That's what I see these days in the country we live in. You know, people love to give out cookies and people eat the cookies and they think they got some sense of truth. But really, they got, you know, cookies, lies. You know what I'm saying? And the thing is, you know, hey, hey you know, you can, you know, hand out cookies all you want to. But when the truth comes, the truth will be stronger, the truth will prevail, the truth will be the truth, and people need to understand it and become mature to accept the truth and stop accepting lies, you know what I'm saying, if they really want real, if you really want real, you got to do that, I mean, everybody think they try to endure fake, you know, so I can see people they like to do a fake reality, a reality that really is not exist, or they're trying to make it exist. You know what I'm saying? And it doesn't exist, but as much as you believe it and try to, of course I say, as much as you make the cookie hard, make it solid or something, it's still going to be a cookie. As, you know, as much as many embrace it. So the thing is, don't waste your time making cookies, you know what I'm saying? Be, make your time uh, creating something that is solid, that will, and dependable, and that will stand within, within anything, and that is the truth. And the truth, of course, what the scripture says, will set you free, but lies will keep you in bondage, you know what I'm saying? And lies will give you disappointment, truth will take you to your appointment, you know what I'm saying? And the thing is, you know, I tell people, look, if you don't want to eat fake food, if you don't want to ride a fake car that drive, you should not desire anything that's fake. That's how I look at it. If you want a true car and eat true food, you eat true food. That's how it's real that simple. You know what I'm saying? So I pray that you will desire to be a rock and stop being these cookies and you know, and start getting cut by these people and want to shape and make a false reality to you concerning what they want you to believe and really operate it in confusion and conflict and chaos. And you really will never have no stability when you're in a, play, a fake place of lies. All right, that's the message. God be the glory of him forever. Amen.